It's the Joel Shit Show featuring Joel Shit. Hi, welcome to the Joel Shit Show. I'm your host, Joel Shit. So today's the day, first day at the new job, corporate consumer communications, consumer corporate communications professional at IDT. Hooray for me! In your face, all the people that got in my way. Actually, no. Smell my farts because I'm not going to get in your face because it's going to keep me from progressing in my own life. So I'm going to go and put my shirt on and pants and shoes and a belt. Hopefully I still fit in them. I've been eating a lot in case you haven't, in case you couldn't tell. Watch an episode from like August but I'm like, and then watch an episode now where I'm like, Bleh. you know, it's a little noticeable. I kept exercising. I was just eating more. So now I have to eat less. So no better way to start than today when I'm being taken out to lunch. Excellent. But uh, yes, it's all very exciting. I will be on the road, 12 minute commute, right off the freeway, right on the freeway, right off the freeway, done. So I'm looking forward to that. Yesterday I watched football and I was pretty happy. Opening drive, 49ers drive down the field, touchdown. Boy, it sure would be funny if that were the only touchdown in the game. So let's check it out, Buffalo Bills fans. I know you're mad at Ryan Lindell. I know he's a little asshole to you, right? Oh my god, he missed a 20-yard field goal. Oh my god, he missed a 40-yard field goal. Two things. First of all, he made 53 in a row inside 40. Does that include 40-yard? I don't know. Inside 40 should not include 40-yard field goals, but regardless. That's a lot of field goals to make. So be happy he missed them in a game he wouldn't have won anyway. But what are you talking about? Well, it's very simple. The two field goals resulted in six points. For Buffalo, if they had made them, that would have made it 10 to 9. And, and, off of those missed field goals, the 49ers didn't score. 10 to 9. Still would have lost. Trey Edwards still would have gotten hurt. So, what are you, are you so worried about, huh? Nothing. 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 Be a little more concerned that Trey Edwards is hurt. And he strained his groin after doing too many Stanford co-eds. That is something to be worried about. Unless you think J.P. Freely is going to be no loss, man. I don't think so. Buffalo is in trouble. You might as well just start loss for the rest of the year so you don't win any more games. Bring back Alex Van Pelt. Do something. Because 6-10, and 10, your best bet. Get a good draft pick. Try for next year. Sorry, at least you're not the Oakland Raiders. Can't even beat the Chiefs. Oh, Kansas City. So the time we have today, visit us on the web at joelshitshow.com. Email joel at joelshitshow.com.